Australian Warren Rodwell was kidnapped in December 2011 while alone in his home in Ipil, Sambuanga, Sibugay. Europeans Ewald Horn and Lorenzo Binsigera were abducted by armed men while bird watching last February in Tawi Tawi Island. And just a month ago, Jordanian journalist Bakir Atiani and his Filipino crew went missing in Sulu and believed to have also been abducted. Aside from these foreign hostages, a number of Filipinos, including a town mayor, are also in the hands of kidnappers. The BNP admits kidnap for ransom remains to be a major security issue in some parts of Mindanao, where anti-terrorism laws have proved to be challenging for both the police and the military to enforce. One kidnapping incident is a serious matter, ano, regardless of the victim. Pwede natin sabihin Pilipino yan, a Filipino-Chinese, O sabihin na natin talaga foreigner, ano? So, ang approach naman ng ating pamalan, particular na po ang Philippine National Police, ay iisa naman. So, regardless kung anong nationality ng victim. The PNP's anti-crime units have been monitoring the status of these kidnapping cases, while the DILG supposedly is on top of the Atiani case. Intelligence sources say local officials have tapped civilian mediators to negotiate for the release of the hostages but are often hounded by problems on funds to pay for ransom. The government says it is strictly adhering to the no-ransom policy in dealing with kidnappers. Ine-employ naman po ng Philippine National Police all conceivable na approaches or strategies ano, or tactics as long as hindi ito magbabiolate po no, ng mga ating uh, Yung karaniwang mga policy po natin o guidelines mula po sa ating uh, sa, sa itaas. Ano? Ang, again, inuulit ko po, ang uh, primordial concern po ng PNP dyan, eh, of course, may rescue po natin ng ligtas yung ating mga hostages. Kaya. President Aquino said in his 2011 SONA that addressing the basic needs of the security forces such as increased pay and housing programs are just some ways to toughen the resolve in combating terrorism and lawlessness. But with more hostages languishing in captivity as he delivers another SONA, the President may have to consider other options, even drastic ones, to put an end to the kidnappings in the South. David Santos, Solar News.